¡Madre mía! Suelta eso. Mírale cómo tiembla. Parece un flan. Nadie podría preguntar lo mismo. No quiero ningún problema. Esto está lleno de blancos, tíos. Tengo que huir de aquí. Que no soy de Crawford. Y esta gente con lo de Crawford, macho. No sé de dónde está. No sé de dónde está. Creo que es mejor empezar a hablar. Vine aquí con un pequeño grupo esperando encontrar un barco. Solo quiero salir de aquí. ¿Por qué no me dejes ir? No hay barcos por aquí. Crawford tomó todo. Sí, lo he escuchado. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it! You're right. Oh, amenaza los. Sí, sí, sí. El fucking nigga aquí amenazando a la gente. Vamos ahí. Que soy del Brown, tío. Que soy del Brown. Baja la pistola. Put the fucking gun down before you really make me mad. He's bluffing. You think so? Try me. Keep back. Or I swear I'll shoot. Te mato. No, I don't think so. I know killers. Puto niga, eh? Qué peligroso es. Qué cojones tiene. Mírale. That means you ain't got the balls. Now drop the goddamn gun. Eh, movimiento ninja. Huya. Ahora, desarmado. Now tell me, who the hell are you people? You say you're not from Crawford, but you sure as hell act like it. Guess you just have to take my word for it. Who the hell are you people? Why should we tell you anything? Because now I'm the one holding the gun. Start talking. We are from Crawford. Or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place. Started weeding out the sick and the old. So their perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so... You see? My friend here asked you a question. Eh, el nigga. We're sick. We belong to a cancer survivors group that used to meet at the hospital here. Now we're in remission, but that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before we managed to hole up and hide down here. What is this? A morgue? Yeah. Irony's always top of my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. Now I don't care if you have a gun or not. I want to know how you found your way down here. A few of us got boxed in by walkers up on the street. Came down here trying to get away. Now I just want to get out of here and get back to my own people. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? You expect us to help you after the way you busted in here and terrorized us? Hey, if I got in your face a little, that's too bad. All this shit that's gone down has made us all a little punchy. I just want to get home. I hear you, but we all got our own problems. Two of our people are sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Besides, why should we help you? Esta gorda que pasa contigo. Because this is your other option. You can either show me the way back or die right here. Amenazando. What's it gonna be? Son of a bitch. Or reviento. Dilo otra vez. Te salto los dientes. We've all got our own problems. It's all right, Bree. I'll show you the way back to your people, and then I hope I never see you again. Deal. Yo voto por venir aquí con todo el grupo, saquear todo esto y quedarnos toda la comida. Ya hemos llegado. Clementine, Clem. Pues estoy la niña, tío. Y la Molly esta qué hace? Bueno, por lo menos ha venido para aquí. Oh, hey, you made it back. 
Who's this? Una ninja. He didn't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. Who's the fossil? Where's Clementine? She's around here somewhere. Relax. I got her and Kenny both back safely. You're welcome, by the way. You're welcome, dice. Esta es mi casa, no tuya. Zorra. I think you have something that belongs to me. Ah, sí, el piole. Toma. ¿Quieres otra cosa larga y con mango? ¿Eh? No, no contestas. Bueno, vale. Thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? <coughs> it's Omid. He's gotten worse. Much bueno, worse. Eso no pasa nada, hombre. Se un tiro y ya está. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? You have to help us. Please. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. No sé, al final nos va a servir de ayuda, Luis Jales. Omid, honey, you're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. Joder, yo que quería ver cómo la amputas la pierna. O si necesitas que se la ampute yo, me avisas. Que tengo experiencia. Clementine. A ver, Clementine, ¿dónde estás, hija mía? A ver, por aquí va a ser que no. Bueno, o sí. Clementine, you in here? Where is she? Clementine. Uh, un niga enterrando un chucho. ¿De dónde habrá sacado esa idea? Clem, you in here? Clementine, you here? Clementine. You up there? Shit. Where could she be? Hello? Molly, ahora que estamos a solas. What are you doing? Oh, you know, just poking around. Well, what? You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Don't ask me, I'm not her keeper. Hey, do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? Uf, madre mía, ahí agacha, quédate así. Molly? I told you, that girl isn't with me. Go ask your buddies and quit bothering me. Si es que me estás provocando. Deja con el culo así. Yo soy un hombre. No soy de piedra. Bueno, a ver. Vámonos. Abajo. Dice que está abajo, pues vamos para abajo. ¿Esto qué es? Joder. Madre mía, espacio habitaciones, ¿no? Clem? Clementine? Clementine! Come out! Please! Joder, macho. Lee, tranquilízate un poco. Kenny? Bueno, el Kenny. El Kenny lleva una encima. Oh, hey, you made it back. Good <coughs> job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. 
You want to throw down again like back on the train? Cuz I fight better when I'm shit faced. Dame la botella, que yo también quiero ver. Give me that. Kenny, give me the damn bottle. Get the fuck away from me. Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked. Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us. That crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? Come on, Rejón. Como bebas, te mete una hostia que te, te dan palmas las orejas. Mira, 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 que se ha cagado. Dame la botella, hombre. Bah. A ver, vamos a preguntarle a este. Si sabe dónde está. Have either of you seen Clementine? Damn if I know. Gotta be around here somewhere. Ben, how did Clementine sneak out of the house? Hey, don't put all that on me. Omid took a turn for the worse, and Chris asked me to help. I'm sorry, I'm doing the best I can here. She was frantic and things got kind of crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. What else could I do? That's not good enough. Whatever. Don't give me that whatever shit. Just tell me where she is. I think she went out to play in the backyard. On her own. With no one watching her? Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. She better be or it's your ass. Oh, que te mato. Clementine? Clementine! Esta música tan chunga, tío. La habrá pasado algo a la niña. Doors covered in pots. Don't think anyone came in through there. Sana de los pies por fuera. Pues aquí no está la niña, eh. Ahí está, ya sé por dónde se ha metido. La niña está dentro, seguro. Como que mierda. <risa> mierda. Holy shit. Pero de alegría. Holy shit. Swear. Mercury, borracho pero contento. Ahí está el tío. Ahora solo falta que la palme 
Se la palme el Omid este y nos vamos. Omid's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound, but he's got a real infection. Running a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Well? <sighs> you want the good news or the bad news? Eh, la buena, joder. I think we could all use some good news. Good news is, the boat's seaworthy enough. In pretty good shape, mostly. Mostly? That's the bad news. Gas tank's empty, and her battery's dead. We need to fix both before she's taking us any place. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? We should go back out on the street, see what we can find. That's not gonna work. Crawford took everything and brought it inside their walls. Pues they Crawford. siphoned every gas tank, Los stripped every battery. There's nothing left out there. You saw that for yourselves. She's right. Well, what about this Crawford place? Sounds like they'd have everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on. on. Surely we have to try. If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man? Might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. We're armed and we've got the numbers. I say we just go in there and take what we need by force. Okay, that is literally the dumbest idea I have ever heard. Crawford's like a goddamn military base. They've got hundreds of people in there armed to the teeth. And that perimeter's guarded day and night. You're gonna have to be smarter than that. Oh, maybe we can be. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. Okay, that's not bad. That's better. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. Yeah, what do you yeah, want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? Let's do this. We can do this. Vamos. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Are we seriously talking about this? I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. Mola, 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 mola. Ataque, ataque nocturno. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? It's what going to be dangerous? Crawford. I can't lie to you, Cliff. Yeah. It's gonna be dangerous, but it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. That could happen, but we have to take that risk because it's just as dangerous not to. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Sí, hombre. 
¿Tú te flipas o qué? Said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Where I'm going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Joder, qué pesa eres con ese tema, macho. A la puta hora que te lo dije. Can't I come with you? No. No. I'm sorry. Es que allí no quieren a niños. Imaginaros que la capturan o lo que sea, la matan, yo qué sé. Voy a saber. Que se quede aquí y ya está. Si total, peor que me llevo ya con ella, no me puedo llevar. Que me mata. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? A What's up? Pasa, Kenny? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So we're gonna have a capacity problem. Boat that size ain't gonna hold more than five people. Even with one of them a kid. Me, you, Clem, Krista, Omi, Ben, Molly. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, that's still one too many. Even if we cut Molly loose. Before this is over, we're gonna have to make a decision. You're not serious. Look, I'm just saying, if we want the best chance... Claro, se queda Omi y Clementine también. <laughs> bueno, coño, el orejón. El primero, vamos, al agua. This? this is Bree. She can help us. ¿Cómo? Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Hold up just a sec. You understand why you have to stay behind, don't you? I guess. Plus, you have a job to do. An important job. I need you to stay here and watch over the house. Watch over Omid. What should I do if something happens while you're gone? Here. Toma, donde eres una fucking niga como yo. You remember how to use it, don't you? It's just like I showed you. I remember. So if anyone tries to get inside the house that isn't one of us, or if something does happen to Omid... I know what to do. Let's get you inside. Let's get this over with. Where? El fucking nigga y su pandilla de matones del Bronx. This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We go in hard, hit them by surprise, grab what we need and get the hell out. We need to do this fast, so everybody stay sharp, stay alert, and stay close together. Algo va a pasar aquí. Me lo presiento. Algo va a pasar aquí. No sé por qué. Me da que aquí se lía. Bueno chicos, tenemos que abrir esto, pero lo que vamos a hacer va a ser quedarnos aquí, porque me da que aquí se va a liar una de la hostia, vamos, ¿no? que nos van, que nos van a pillar, estoy seguro. Así que nada, nos vemos en la siguiente parte de este The Walking Dead. Espero que os esté gustando, como siempre, y hasta pronto.